Killer Run, STDI here, and this is the final episode of Dark Souls 2. We are finally here. We are finally going to end this episode, end this journey of ours, and go kill Nashandra and Aldia, and talk to Shenlot, which I firmly believe is our queen. Firmly believe it. Now I'm gonna shut up. My journey is already complete. My name is Shanalot. The dragon gave me this name, for I was born with none. I was born of dragons, contrived by men. By ones who would cause him fate herself. They are the ones who created me. But they failed. I did not come out as intended. Fate would not be bested. And men were cursed once again. If you proceed, Nashandra will come after you. Knowing that you will take the throne and link the fire. She covets the first flame and the great soul. Put Nashandra to rest. Okay. She's talking about Aldia and Ventric. Also, that is a Dagger. She's a fucking half dragon and she has a fucking dagger. Why? Just why? I guess self defense if you want to put it like that. But, um. This is it. It's the final fight. Well. Technically, yes. Because you can choose this to be your final fight. But we're not gonna. We're gonna fight Aldia. For the first time, so be prepared for fails, derps, and everything like that. And also, I should probably go and upgrade the great sword. It's only plus eight. You know, in plus ten, it's like four hundred or five hundred damage. That is a lot of damage. Oh, three of them? Bradley, the old guard. Huh? No, Bradley, no. Sorry, guys, this is a fight of my own. This is a fight we can't do ourselves. Don't no, skip it. I don't give a fuck about your quest to become a queen. We're cursed. Come here, Nashandra. I don't have any ranged weapons. Come on. I mean, I have a bow weapon. It's useless. Come here. I wanna fight you 1v1. Already. Well, it already is a 1v1 fight. I just wanna fight you. Without the curse things going around me. I really hate that shit. And I hate the scythes in this game. I really hate the scythes. Like, the scythes are just. I don't like them. I really don't like the scythes. They're ugly. Oh fuck, oh fuck. Hmm. This is easy. Oh. Don't worry. We're still not fucking pros, so don't worry about it. This is our next area of fighting. Come on, Nashandra. I love the laser attack, but come here. I wanna fight you. Melee versus melee. No, seriously, come on. Come here. Fuck the laser attack. Come on. I have no ranged weapons. Come on. 
I only have a lance and a sword. I use a sword. I mean, I believe it's not useless when you upgrade to plus 10, but um, I don't know. Maybe it is useless. Maybe it is. But Nashandra is easy. She is easy, guys. It's okay to die the first time to Nashandra, but more than two times. It actually makes no sense. Personally, I'm not trying to crap on anyone's skills. I'm just being reasonable. And she is dead. This is it. Now we get to fight Aldia. I think. Here he is. One round of poison. He's talking about uh, the free actions. You conqueror of adversities. It was your answer. Okay. So he was talking about the DLC kings, you know, the Sunken King, the the Iron King, and the Frozen King of the Lone Lois. And here he is the big G-Man himself. The G-Man, really? Did I just say the G-Man? Oh yeah, he's actually impervious when you. Okay. He, he he seems standard for now. <coughs> Sorry about the cough, guys. I really wasn't able to. Damn it! Oh shit! Don't tell me. That motherfucker has homing fire souls. I mean, why fire of all things? Come on. Fire so 2014. And <laughs> I just said that. Fuck me, why the. Ugh. Trust me, guys, I hate. Whoa. I forgot, it has. Actually, it has more than just. <gasps> what is that? What OP ability is that? Aldia, Aldia, no, stop it. <laughs> was that like a spirit bomb or something? <laughs> Cause that was awesome. I see that. Ta fuck me. Yeah, do that. No! St oh, wait. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. He's gonna... He's gonna blow! Good. Good. I hate that attack! I hate that attack. I hate it. Can we do the AOE? Do the AOE attack. Uh -huh. I doubted myself, and that's what I get for doubting.
No! Oh, that was close. That was close. Oh, he disappeared. Just stop disappearing for fuck's sake. Oh, no, actually, that's a good thing. I can do a lot of damage to him. 600 and. Who's doing this pay time? Okay, it takes around 10 seconds to charge. I have 10 seconds to spare. Oh, I, I, I attacked. For no reason whatsoever, I attacked. Okay, he disappeared. Where, where is he? Okay, wait for the initial AoE. I can do it. Two attacks. Two attacks, then it's a dangerous thing. Oh, he's angry. Or is he not? Dun dun dun, or something like that. And a spirit bomb. And remember, I have ten. I have the time to attack him and then run away. Actually, I have more time than that. But uh, you know, you better be sure than not. Also, I think that's now a one shot, or it will take me more than. It's gonna take me a lot. It's gonna take away a lot of HP. Two attacks. Okay, one attack now. One attack. Oh, shit. You know what? No. I like. I, I love this shield. This shield was a useful, useful get. Mm. I'm wondering, is he, is he immune to poison? I think he is. This is the final boss. And the music is awesome. Okay, no. 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 I wanna heal. I wanna be sure. Better heal and survive another attack than try to kill him and then not. And then die. Th there is a there is a argument for that. Also, I'm sorry if you cannot hear any of the music from my talking. I'm really sorry about that. <laughs> and we're done! Wow! We did it! Fucking did it! And we get no souls. And remain here patiently. A throne will certainly receive you. But the question remains. What do you want? Tell me. Light, dark, or something else entirely? That's it. Two paths. One leads to the breakage of the world circle and leaving away Shanelot and the throne. And one leads to repeating all the things that happened. Of course, we want the world's great sword, for it is our greatest weapon. No. Any more of you. <sighs> this is it, guys. This is it. We're done. I'm gonna shut up now, and you're gonna see the ending. Goodbye. Of course, I mean, we're gonna talk again later. I'm gonna shop now. There is no path. Beyond the sleep of light, beyond the reach of dark. What could possibly await us? And yet we seek it in 
unceasingly, such as our fate. Okay, guys, that was beautiful. That was fucking beautiful, and um, I enjoyed the game. I enjoyed the game. The game is worth thirty-five euros. How much I paid? The game is worth it. Uh, I, I recommend the game. Uh, for anyone who doesn't have Dark Souls Two and the DLC, go get it. If you have Dark Souls Two but don't have DLC, go buy this game. Game is half the price, and you get everything: the DLC, the upgrade graphics, everything. I recommend getting it. The game is just beautiful, and uh, this ending is way better than the other one. Like, yes, we leave everything. We leave this world. We break. We broke this world. Everything. Uh, Lucatil is insane. Benhart stayed in the dream. Um, Kale has lost his mind. The shopkeeper, I forgot what his name is, the, the armor seller, he lost his mind. Gilligan is still sane, somewhat. We're leaving Shamlot behind, we're we talking about her. The, the, the blacksmith and his daughter, they're never gonna meet, never. They're always gonna st stay away from each other, they're never gonna interact. Or maybe they will. There is no path. There is no fu the future is versatile and has so many endings, so many paths, that we ourselves cannot see it. That's why no one can see in the future. And so in this game, the NPCs, it stays like this. There's no changing it. We we're not going to restart it. We are we are just going to end it. And we end it. We ended the curse. There is no, there is no more curse of Jen Lake. There is no more repeating. There is nothing. We, we are free to do what we want to do. Because humans are free, and so we are free also. And that's what it means to be a human, I guess. We are all, we are, we are all humans. We all think differently. We are all free to do and see whatever we want to do. And the only one who will judge us is us and the society. No one else. No one else is allowed to judge you. The rules, uh, the social rules, the justice, laws, and everything like that. It's society. In a world without society, you can just live in the woods and you don't know about the law. You don't know about the law that society brought upon you or on us, I guess, in this point. So there's no laws. But that's just to be avoided, and I'm not going to talk about this. In the game sense, you're free. We've broken the curse, we've broken the circle, the cycle actually, right? the cycle. And this is it. We're walking a path of darkness, but in every but in every dark tunnel, there is little light at the end. It shines new path and luck and happiness. So I guess that that, that that's it. That, that is it. I don't know what else to talk about. I don't think we can skip the cutscenes. No, we can't. So, the ending is beautiful. The music in this game is beautiful also. Oh man, the music. The voice acting, superb, everything. And this sounds like I'm giving a review. I'm actually not. I don't like reviews that much. Uh, there's people way better than, than I could ever be in reviews. So. But yeah, this is beautiful. And I can only give high prizes to it. If anybody asks me, I can only say good things about this game. There are bad, there are bad things, but the goods, the good things outshine the bad ones. It just plain, it's just plain. If you want, if you are a PC gamer and you don't have a PS4 and you cannot play Bloodborne, this is a perf, this is an okay replacement for it, an okay one until Dark Souls 3 comes out. It's an, okay, it's a great replacement for it. So yeah. Please don't tell me he's gonna give. Yeah. Yeah. He's gonna give us the both one. The Dark Souls called the first sin and the the original Dark Souls. 
now that we're out of the way of uh, this up unbelievable ending and the game, uh, let's talk about the channel again, because we did just finish a game. Uh, plans for the future are... I hope I get better a little bit, so I don't have to cough as much. Um, I hope that... Uh, I end Legion of Battle Mage a little bit quicker than I did Dark Souls 2 because it did take me 40 something episodes to actually end the game. So, but Legion of Battle Mage, I hope it it lasts a little bit less. If it doesn't, hey, what I can do? What, what can I do for it? Nothing. But I hope, I can hope. I can hope it, it lasts less. It, it Around, I guess, 20 30 episodes would be perfect. I don't know. So. That's the thing. Um, the DLC is going to come after Bleachstone Bellmage. I've been thinking about it, and uh, I just finished playing. I just finished playing the, playing a game, and uh, now the DLC. I mean, no, I, I just put a little stuff to Dark Souls, and then play some Bleachstone Bellmage and finish that. Then comes the DLC. Also, another thing is I've been thinking about, and I might go online for the DLC. Because the bosses are harder and uh, having some help for them would be perfect. So I've been thinking about it and uh, I think I'm going to do that. I'm going to be online for the DLC. <clears throat> that, that is the plan, actually. Now, that might something go horribly wrong. I don't know. But uh, that, that is the plan. Anyways, that is the plan. Another thing is, if any of you want to to co-op with me or you know just thinking about you know joining me on adventures of the DLC why not I'm gonna start I'm you're gonna see you're gonna hear more about this at the end of the Legion Battle Mage episodes which when I now upload that uh, I'm gonna hear more about that but for now uh, nothing I'm just doing some way so what is Liquid Violet? Oh, I don't know. Oh yeah, there's Shalad Child, there's Captain Drummond, Falcon the Outcast, the Giant. What Giant? Wait, what Giant? Ah, I don't know. Anyways, anyways. So that's that. Um, also, I've been thinking about about streaming actually. I've been thinking about that. About streaming when I'm bored or I don't want to record an episode. I might just you know pull up a little stream and I'll stream like for one hour or two hours. Also I've been thinking about it and uh I've been thinking about it and uh, the big problem, the main problem is uh, that my upload uh, speed is below one megabyte. So that is a problem. I have to see some settings, something to make it fast, to make it watchable. I guess it doesn't have to be 1080p, 1080p doesn't matter. By but yeah. So also another me a small problem is uh, that. I don't have a camera, if you can notice, I don't have a camera, so that also doesn't make, so that's gonna be like that, the streams are gonna, just gonna be like YouTube videos, just gonna you know, be alive, I guess. So yeah, that, that is the plan for the future, and this should actually end the cutscene, and we should be teleported to the bonfire. And it will surprise me if they change the bond I know, like changed everything in Majula if it, we choose a different ending. That would be really cool. I, I don't think they did. Yeah, they didn't. Um, anyways, did we get any new soul? Like, did we at least get any new souls? Something like that. Let's see. Let's see. I don't believe Adia drops any souls. No, yeah, Adia doesn't drop any souls. Uh, Nashandra. I'm just gonna level up intelligence for good old days and be done with the episode. That's all. Well, guys, this has been a very interesting episode. Very, ex very 
exciting episode. This has been a really good episode for me to make for me to, and uh, hopefully for you to watch. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.